I actually have a plan. I think I'll take my uh, Cyclops, my one-eyed fly, and I will take it over to where that Reaper is fucking around, put it into silo mode, dive down to the bottom, because I know there's a lot of scrap down there. Whether it's actual scrap, or just decorative scrap, don't know. But I'm gonna hopefully be able to find out and take as much of it with me as possible. Is that titanium? That is titanium. Every little bit is going for me. Oh, I already have two in there. Well, that's nice. That'll save me some time. Oh my God, and I have two more here too. Oh, that's really nice. That's really nice. That's just... Hey, okay, if I don't say so myself. But I want more. I am going to need more anyway, so I may as well collect as much as I can while I am here. Okie dokie. And for those of you out there named Artichoke, yeah. Before the episode is over, I say this now, but later in life when I look at this behind the editing desk, I'm gonna smack myself in the face. I will have enough titanium to create everything, and we will finish upgrading the CMOS this episode. So that next time we can take it out exploring. Excuse me, I could use the light. There it is. All this salvage has regenerated, I swear. It regenerates after you turn the game off. That's what I feel is the case. And then all the stuff seems to come back. Because I know I picked all of this up before. I've done all of this looting. I've been playing this game for so long, I've become oblivious to the beauty that the sea really holds. I just had a moment where I stopped and I looked at it in complete silence and went, this is nice. It's a shame when you get so wrapped up in something or so unappreciated of it that you forget that it's... It's a thing that can be enjoyed and isn't just something that's there that you should pay no mind to. The area I live is perfect of this too. It's a beautiful mountainous lush area, especially this time of year being springtime. For me anyway. And I forget! because I've lived here pretty much all of my life. And I never pay attention to it anymore. But whenever I have friends from my own town come in and they rant and rave about how beautiful the place is, it really gives me that nice reminder of reality. A good smack to, you know, pay attention to your surroundings. Look how wonderful things are. Then again, I think in Subnautica, I've only ever really had that feeling in this particular biome at the top near everything because this is the area where the least amount of things are trying to kill me. All right, I complained about getting ingots being difficult, but every trip I go out there, I'm able to get at least 32 pieces of titanium fairly quickly. And every trip takes me two to three minutes. So who am I to really complain? Turning out to be not as hard as I thought. I'm gonna have ample portions of titanium and then some. Oh, that's all she wrote for now. And we will store the rest of you in here. And then we'll just take one of you and put it in here. One more trip? I think we will do one more trip in the this the in the this direction. Okay. I've got enough titanium ingots to last me a fair chunk of time. Especially if that whole thing with them, the, the pressure compensators, Captain. not stacking all systems online. So, before I go back to make all that, I actually want to do this, and this is not so much for because I need it, but more so it's just that I want to do it. So let's go into Reaper territory and say hi to him. Link for silent running. Down at the... Doesn't sound very silent. There we go. There we go. All right. Let's go find this Reaper and let's go invade his space as a innocent nothingness that will be nearby. Oh, that's it. That's the threshold right there. I know what's on the other side of this. It is a lot of the big scary dude. 
So let's keep an eyes open for scrap. Preferably large amounts. There's at least two there. And potentially something else there. And there. And and there. And there he is. Alright, so all of our fish are in the buckets. Unfortunately, me going out there is going to result in... Oh, fuck. He'll kill me if I go out there, won't he? Hi, buddy! I had an idea today involving these guys. They were terrifying at first, but they are in nature a serpent-like creature, and I am very fond of those things. And hes uh, he is pretty cool. Ugh, this is dumb. This is going to get me killed. Who wants to watch me die? Because it's about to happen. Oh, I'm right on top of him, aren't I? Maybe he doesn't know I'm here. I'm not gonna pull up my sea glide because my sea glide makes noise. And I'm hoping I'll be quieter this way. Oh, there's that noise. You just stay where I can see you. There was one over here, I thought. Oh, maybe I was wrong. Well, now he's coming after me. Now he's coming after me. Let's just go hide down here. Woo! <laughs> Fucking hell! We are ready to make a hasty exit. Okay! You become a lot scary again when I'm not behind my tank! Mastered the art of corners! More metal savage! More oh my god, there's a lot down here. Jesus Christ. Oh fuck! Oh, okay. Okay, let's see if we can get back to this. Yes, I have 30 seconds to get back there in one piece. One shot! One shot! Don't fuck this up, don't fuck this up, I'm fucking it up! Oh, I fucked it up, I fucked it up! I fucked it up! Oh, I fucked it up! I'm not dead. Fox. Outside of your big fat friggin' monstrosity that they won't touch. Oh. 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 My hands are hot and numb. My head hurts from when I smacked it. Everything is bad. Am I gonna stop? No, I'm not gonna go do that again. Yeah. Yeah, let's, let's go get more titanium salvage. Why not? If it touches me again, I will be dead. Maybe, maybe we go look for it somewhere a little bit further away from him. As you know. Oh look! There's a lot of it right down there. Oh shit, uh, where's the front? Where's the front? One. Oh my god, there's so much down there. I wasn't wrong in my assumption of there being a lot here. And now comes the fun part. Okay, okay, so here's the plan. Here's the crazy ass plan that we are gonna try to do. We're gonna take the thing that he will not touch. For whatever reason, we are gonna park it right close to the bottom and essentially create a wedge. So now, if he wants to go after me, he's gonna have to get under this thing to do it. So, fuck you, Reaper! I don't want to do it. <sighs> How many healing things? I don't. Okay. Goodbye, world! And go! Go, 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 Salvage, 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 salvage. Oh, that's not salvage shit. That's, that's also not salvage that I <laughs>
to have my stasis rifle. Oh good, that's all I need. Fuck. Fuck! Fuck! I'm done! I'm done! You win! Fuck! I don't know where it is! I don't know where anything is! Oh my god! Where's the opening? Where's my fucking opening? Open, damn you! Let me in! Let me in! I'm sorry! I'm done! I'll go upgrade the Z-Moth! I'm done! No more! Not happening! Not until I can neutralize those things in a better way than the stasis rifle! Good God! I, oh yeah, yeah, I know, I'm very close. I'm leaving! Fucking done with the Reaper! <sighs> Metal salvage can be found in other places. I don't need to come here for it. Oh, I feel stick to my stomach. I can feel it churning over from the stress. Oh, God. Oh, why do I do these things to myself? For pleasure? For your entertainment? Oh, God, I don't want to do that. I don't want to go explore the deep anymore. Do I have to? I don't have to, do I? I want my mommy. Not my actual mommy. My Captain. metaphorical make me feel better because of comfort reasons, mommy. Okay, here we go. Um, let's just finish this up and then we're gonna get back to your face. Cool. Cool, cool. Where is the sea moth? Over there. Is that in the moon pool? I don't know if that's in the moon pool. Oh, moon pool. Nope, of course not. Why would I ever park the sea moth in the moon pool? That would be smart. That would make sense. Alright. Fuck. Fuck a duck. Let's, uh, ammunition. All oh, right. Um, how does one restock? Is it as simple as parking in the moon pool? I should figure this out right now. Cause yeah, at the moment I don't have torpedoes. I think that works for things when they have me grab, like reapers, for example. Oh yeah, this is gonna drain the rest of the power for this base. Oh, I gone dicked myself. Now there's no power here, and I am slowly dying. Oh, well, that's not helping. Fuck, my inventory's full. Can I drop this? Fuck, I'm gonna drown inside my own base. Fuck, 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 fuck. And of course, it won't let go of my thing now, so I have to repower my base. Oh, something's happening. Power restored. All and power restored. systems online. This happened a lot for my searching. It was just on and off. On and off. Over and over. Again and again and again. And the power keeps going like 275, 300, 275, 300. Either way, there's power. I have power, so maybe, just maybe, I can get my Z-Moth out. I just wanted to see if I could like reload the torpedoes from here. Oh, that's unpowered. Can I, can I get in? Okay, it'll let me in. That's... Now, the question is, did that, did that reload? Exit the re and restock at Torpedo Bay. Well, what the fuck's a Torpedo Bay? I have to figure this out. All right, um, back to the Isle of Cow and figure out what a Torpedo Bay is. Try me, Reaper. I will shock your fucking face off. I warn you, I do it. You will not like it. I'm glad that's infinite uses. But if I can only have one of them, then that means I can put something else in my Seamoth. Oh, Jesus. I thought I was about to be 
be struck by debris from the space above me. And I was like, is there another ship coming down that I completely missed? Oh yeah, I'm miffed. My communications relay has given me nothing for a very long time now. And to me, that means I've depleted everything it has to offer, which is very annoying. Because I enjoyed looking for life pods and whatnot. But now I'm getting just not a lot of nothing. Nope, not a nothing. Whoopsie, sorry. I should fix this thing. So once we have this guy upgraded and able to go deep depths, Maybe I should have taken my Cyclops over here. Oh well! Our next objective is to go into the deep depths and look for the components that we need to be able to make a prawn suit. If I have the blueprints for it, I just don't have the materials. And then once we have the prawn suit, uh, well, let's not think- Oh yeah, there's an alien base like a kilometer down that I know the kind of sort of location of it and I should go find them. I am here to, right, figure out missiles. Need to figure out missiles. Did I have my repair tool with me? Ah, I do. I just want to fuck you. I don't want to fuck my Sea Moth. I mean, I like my Reaper Beater, but it's not, you know, fuck worthy of all. Oh dear, I have to make torpedoes for this puppy. Sea Moth torpedo storage. Daddy's home! Please charge my Seamoth for me. Thank you so very much. Fabricator, can you fabricate me torpedoes? Torpedoes! Vortex torpedoes, time three for two pieces of titanium. I would like to have some gas torpedoes, but I have no gas pots. Okay, so that's, that's torpedo. That's that problem solved. This is it! This is what I've been working the whole episode to do! You! Make me see you need play steel ingots and aluminum oxide. So, precious. Aluminum oxide. And lithium. So that we may go to our fabricator and fabricate ourselves some play steel ingots. Is that his spot? Is that all I need to spot? I don't remember now. What was it too? It was definitely too. So if we will go in here, and we will not do that, we will not do that, we will do that, and we will do one more! And now we have two! And now since we have two, we will go into the Seamoss upgrade, and we will make Princess Compensator Mach 2! ta -da! And since we are already here, and we are well on our way, why the fuck not make number three two? One, two, three! And then we go over here, and we will make a few more play stealing it. As these guys right here, Mark. Oh fuck! Right! I'm a human being! I need sustenance to keep myself alive! I'm sorry, I got so excited! I worry about you later, this is more important! This is progress for science! As a famous man whom I very much enjoyed listening to as a kid says, Science rules. Do 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 my sea moss to my sea moss to my sea moss. Why did I have to make this place look good, good from the outside? It's is a maze on the inside. Okay. Which side has the that side? That side does. Okay. First of all, pressure compensator. There you go. 900 meters. Welcome aboard, Captain. 
Yeah, I guess they don't stack. Um, let me back in. Thank you. 900 fucking meters. That's three more than the fucking Cyclops. That's deep. I'll be able to get some stuff with that. Okay, but I have a decision to make. So I have that with the torpedoes, and I have that for protection. What else do I want? I, I don't want the sonar. Not at all. Let's see my solar charger. <sighs> no, because if I'm going to be down deep, that's going to be pointless. Don't need that. Hall reinforcements. Have one of those. Hard to chest before it closes. Limited damage under normal conditions. That'd be like running into walls and whatnot, so I find that probably useless. So it's either that one or storage. So... Storage gives me a 4x4 locker, which will allow me to carry 16 things, whereas the power module reduces the amount of energy cells I will need to use. However, if I have a storage thing, I can store more energy cells in there that'll be burnt off depending on the ratio between them. Because a power efficiency modulator, I don't know how long of a percentage it'll reach for each of the um, power cells that I put in there, where a storage thing, I could theoretically put 16 in there, and which one would do more? Because 16 just would be more reason. I'll probably go for storage. Which is titanium. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Alright, let's just go pick those bad boys up. So I think I just figured something out in the game. Running affects your food levels. Because when I was almost dead from starvation, I couldn't run no more. And that totally makes sense. Nice little touch, I feel. Probably took, you know, no more than a line or two of programming. go. And yeah, that was, that was good. It was very good. I like that. Alright, let's make our final module. Storage space. Da, 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 da. Thank you. And now we will take these and we will <coughs> sauce them on into our sea Damn you, Kate! Huh? Access. Uh, do not need that in there. Do need that. Do need that. And do need that. Now, where is the storage facility? This is a good question. There's storage. Yeah, that's decent. Cool. It'd be nice if I had one on the other side, too. I mean, I could probably put another one on, but I like the other things more. Now, let's go make us some torpedoes. Torpedoes. Make some torpedoes. Two titanium for three torpedoes. Good ratio. Whoops. Oh, shit. They're big. That's why. I just, I wanna, oh god, that's gonna be tricky. Oh my god, I'm bouncing. I'm bouncing so much. So, I lost, oh no, it's still there, cool. Oh, right, it's not here that has the fucking locker. Where is my makey tool? Uh, I don't have my makey tool here. Ah! And again with the full inventory. Well, let's hop in this puppy, launch it, and then store in our torpedoes. And then I think we'll be good! Same on torpedo storage. So I can put four on that side. Now, do they share it? They do. I have four shots. So what I would like to do... Is how many more? Four, five, six. We'll do six. So then we'll hop down here, and we will swim around to our storage in our lovely, lovely Sima. Open storage, and we will put in two more torpedoes for backup, and our two batteries too. Ladies and gentlemen, there is our upgraded Sima. Massive depth capacity of 600, defensive systems A-OK -okay to go. We are ready for a voyage out there into the deep nothingness that is nothing of deep. So, thank you so much everybody for joining in. It feels great to be back in the mood that I am. We'll see you all next time on Aura Gaming.